How to maintain the HP DesignJet Z6 Pro and Z9 Plus Pro 64-inch printer. Before you start, HP recommends that you wear gloves when handling ink supplies. This video contains How to replace the maintenance cartridge How to replace a print head How to conduct periodic maintenance How to replace the maintenance cartridge Go to the printer's front panel and tap the inks icon. Then, at the right-hand side of the screen, select the Other Supplies tab, then select Maintenance Cartridge, Replace, and finally press the blue arrow. The maintenance cartridge is located at the front of the printer, in a slot underneath the front panel. Open the door. The maintenance cartridge has a handle on its front. To remove the cartridge, slide it just partly out of the way, then hold it on each side and use both hands to fully remove it. Be careful, as the maintenance cartridge is heavy. To avoid spills, slide the cartridge horizontally as it is full of ink. Remove the plastic bag from the new maintenance cartridge. Insert the new maintenance cartridge into the slot. When you have inserted it into the printer, close the door. A message on the front panel will confirm that the maintenance cartridge has been successfully installed. How to replace the print head On the printer's front panel, tap the inks icon to replace the print heads. The carriage will move to the removal position. Open the front cover and lift up the latch on top of the carriage. Lift up the cover to access the print heads. To remove a print head, lift up its blue handle. Then, use the blue handle to gently disengage the print head. Gently pull it upwards until the print head is released from the carriage. Warning, do not pull abruptly. That could damage the print head. Remove the orange protective caps by pulling them down. How to install the new print head. The print head is designed to be inserted into any available slot, but once the print head is has been inserted into a slot, it will only work with that combination of colors. Insert the print heads one by one. Push each print head into the slot until it clicks into place. The front panel will detect and display them print heads once they're detected inserted. Close the print head cover, the carriage latch, and the window. After closing the window, the printer will purge the print heads. This operation takes around 10 minutes. Once the printer finishes checking the print heads, check has finished, the product printer will start preparing the ink system. Aligning a print head. The printer will automatically align a new print head. A print head is replaced or installed in a different slot. To manually request a print head alignment, select the option from the front panel, then tap OK. The automatic print head alignment workflow window will appear. Tap OK. This is the image the printer prints to align the print head you replaced. How to conduct periodic maintenance. From time to time, you will need to do the periodic maintenance your printer needs. This periodic user maintenance consists of two steps. One, cleaning and lubricating the carriage rod and cleaning the encoder. Two, cleaning the platen. Important. When you have finished doing the maintenance, you must press the reset counter to tell the printer that the maintenance is completed and to start a new maintenance period counter. Go to the front panel, tap the settings icon, then press preventive maintenance. Open the front cover. Clean the carriage rod using a clean cloth dampened with a general purpose industrial cleaner, such as Simple Green. Remember to also clean the part under the right cover. Warning, while you are cleaning, be careful not to damage the plastic encoder strip located at the top of the rod. Dry the rod bar, then close the front cover. Open the front cover again. Now clean the other part of the carriage rod, including the part of the rod under the right cover. Take the bottle of oil from the printer's maintenance kit and put a very thin, zigzag trickle of oil along the rod. Tap OK on the front panel and close the front cover. The carriage will move from one side of the printer to the other to distribute the oil along the whole rod. How to clean the encoder strip. Go to the front panel, tap the settings icon, 
then click on Maintenance, clean the encoder strip. Maintenance should be performed without interruption to keep print heads uncapped the shortest possible time. Otherwise print heads may be damaged. The carriage will start moving. Do not open the print zone window. Open the front cover. Clean the encoder strip on both sides with a cloth dampened with water, as instructed on the front panel, and tap continue when you are finished. Warning, be sure that you clean all of the encoder strip surface, especially the area behind the maintenance cartridge. Close the front cover. The carriage will move to the left side of the printer. The front panel will prompt you to open the cover again and clean the right side of the encoder strip inside the service station. Tap continue when you are finished. Close the front cover again. The carriage will return to its ready position in the service station. Cleaning the platen. Open the front cover. Clean the print platen with a cloth in order to remove ink and media dust. Use a 1 mm pin to unclog every hole in the print platen. Make sure you push the pin all the way through each hole. When you are finished, close the front cover. Once the maintenance is completed, reset the maintenance warning on the front panel. Go to Settings, select Service Menu, then select Service Utilities, and then Reset Life Counters Menu.